My name's Neil Thompson and I drive an Audi R8 GT. So I bought this car in 2013 and uh, the intention was that I was going to buy a V10 R8. What I didn't know was that I was going to end up with a GT and I was very lucky at the time because this car was the only one for sale in the UK and um, after further research I found there's only actually 333 worldwide 18 of which came into the UK. It has had a couple of modifications since buying the car, um, which have mainly been around the engine, an induction kit, also a bespoke map, and a couple of other little tweaks, which gives it 588 horsepower at the wheels. All of the external body styling is standard. Fully loaded with carbon fiber, uh, all of the other extras, Alcantara trim, uh, the racing seats in Alcantara. The handling of the car is actually quite incredible. It's permanent four-wheel drive. It's very evenly balanced. In the dry, it's absolutely incredible. Um, it finds the limits of the driver rather than the limits of the car. In the wet, depending on the type of tyres that you've got, you can still drive the car actually pretty hard. Uh, the traction control, the setup and geometry of the car is quite incredible. However, as with anything in wet conditions, then if it's going to go, it's going to go quickly. But it's a good, sure-footed, great all-round, I would say, all-weather driving car. I love the whole way in which, it was, as with many generation one uh, cars, motorcycles, whatever it is, I really do enjoy the fact that this was the first and this one in particular of the range was a very, very rare model. I believe this is the actual only graphite grey metallic R8 GT in the UK in a coupe version. So for me, I actually don't plan on selling the car at all. The car is going to stay, it'll stay in the family. I think my kids have got plans for that car for them for the future. So who am I to say what I'm going to do with the car? I think it's just going to be one of those things that passes through the family and we carry on the enjoyment.
Neil's car was a bit scary, so we thought we'd chill out a bit. Yo, bro, please. Yo, help, man. Relax. Yo, help. Relax. Oh. Oh. And uh, yeah, we're being my burnout. Oh. We make movies. Come make a movie with us. Uh. If you're wondering oh. why our faces are blurred, oh. I accidentally walked out of the shop with the Kinder Egg. Just gotta lay low for a bit. Yo. Uh. You'll oh. understand in due time. Yo, bro. <laughs> you wanna. <laughs> You wanna, you wanna like help me or something, bro? Bro, shut up and swim, man. You're supposed to be steering the ship. Oh, yo, I can't feel my legs.